Marguerite Poret, the mystic of divine love. Love is divine and I am nothing except love. Who she is. Marguerite Poret is the essence of divine love and the truth that all we are is love. Marguerite was a French Beguine born in the middle 13th century. The Beguine movement was a spiritual revival among women in the late Middle Ages that emphasized an imitation of Christ's life. These Beguines or holy women lived together in a semi-monastic communities. They were not nuns, they didn't take formal vows and could leave at any point, but they lived with shared spiritual intention. Marguerite wrote a spiritual masterpiece titled The Mirror of Simple Souls. It reveals the spiritual process she went through to be transformed by divine love. I am God, says love, for love is God and God is love. And this soul is God by the condition of love. By 1306, the bishop, bishop of Cambrai deemed her work heretical and condemned it to be burned in Porat's presence. Even so, it continued to circulate widely throughout the Middle Ages and in some ecclesiastical centers. It was embraced as an almost canon, canon, canonical piece of of theology. Porat was ordered to stop circulating her book and to recant her ideas of God as love, but she refused. Marguerite was arrested as a relapsed heretic and a free spirit, which included the belief that humans could achieve union with the divine. The Catholic Church conducted an unprecedented trial to decide her fate. Like Joan of Arc, much of her life is recorded because of the transcripts of her lengthy trial. She maintained her truth that the soul has no other will but God's, and that when the soul is united with God's love, this state of union causes the soul to transcend the contradictions of this world. She suggested that we can be transformed by divine love into love itself, which isn't separate from God, and that ultimately no outside source is needed in this transformation. It's between the soul and God alone. Marguerite was burned at the stake in 1310. The mirror of simple souls continued to gain in popularity but was distributed as an anonymous text until 1946. When Romana Garnieri identified Latin manuscripts of the mirror in the Vatican, Marguerite's name returned to the text when it was published for the first time in 1965. When your soul selects her card, there's nothing more powerful than remembering that we are love and there's nothing and no one outside of us that is needed in order to realize this. It is between our experience of the divine and our own soul. We can let go of what we think we need to prove or who we think we need to be in order to receive love because we remember that we are love then we can stand in that truth, even through flames. Marguerite is a courageous truth teller, and the truth of her experience is that love alone can free us. Not the love another might give us, not the love of family or of friends. All of this is powerful and significant, but the true source of love for us is in fact that we are a soul and that the soul is in union with the divine. She reminds us when we've forgotten that love is the essence of who we are, 
and that true love is found within. Marguerite says love has no beginning, no end, and no limit, and I am nothing except love. This is a time to own and to know this truth more fully. It is the most profound and radical act we can ever take, knowing the love we already are. Soul Voice Meditation How can I feel the love that I am more deeply? Intention Love is divine and I am nothing except love.